day. We are back in Petalburg. Don't ask why, because I am going to explain soon. If you did not notice earlier and are blind, there is water over here you can surf on. And if you come over here, you can get item. A Max Revive. Keep this for the Elite Four. And there is another lake over here. With another item that... Whoops, that was a bad... Another item. An ether. And I believe there's actually a hidden item around here, too. No, nope, yes not. Oh, I see where. I missed this in Ruby. <laughs> Must be over here. A rare candy. Rare candies are epic. And that is actually it for this entire episode. So I will see you all next... No, I'm kidding. Um, so, at this point, after you beat this fifth gym, whoops, that was stupid, you need to find a way back to Fortry, and you have to... Well, back to... Slateport, I guess. And you can't just take the ferry from Mr. Briny, because you have the TM for surf... Or HM for surf now. So you have two options. You can go the long and rewarding way, or the short and fast way. Short and fast way is going back up that route where you first fought your rival, Route 103, across that river, which will take you back to Route 110, which is the way we are not going. We are going this long way. I am using super repels, because it is much, much more rewarding, like more rewarding times 10. Um, and I am going right down here. Oops, that was bad. I right, hold on a second. I really need to adjust the camera. Oh, right, there we go. You're gonna start fighting swimmers. The blue, blue sky, the vast sea. It's so peaceful. It's so peaceful. And she has a Meryl, which is actually not what most of the people... The majority of the Pokemon in this route... You may be wondering why I have a Pokemon up that is actually weak to water, is that most of them are Wingulls, which are weak to Rock Tomb, and Tentacles, which are weak to Dig, Psybeam, and Psychic. And sorry, this is just like really ridiculous. All the adjusting I have to do. There we go. Alright, that should be it. And hopefully it doesn't use a water type move, as long as it doesn't do- Oh, critical hit, you're dead. Suck it. Yeah, that's why I don't have my Nuzleaf up front, even though he is a grass type. And also, my Nuzleaf right now sucks. And we've got another swimmer down here. Swimming the deep blue sea, it feels the greatest. Yeah, I'm sure it does. Sure it does. Like, swimming actually is- is pretty fun. Swimmer Dominic spelt with a K. See, this is what I was hoping for. Some nice tentacles to use Psychic on. Or dig, since they have worse defense than special defense. And I hate Supersonic too. Supersonic is one of those moves on my hate list. Um, another one is Self-Destruct and Explosion. I hate having those used on me. Ah, oh, crap. Well, actually, my defenses are, like, so beast it shouldn't do too much. Actually, that did more than I thought it would. Crap. Speed drop. Never good. Fortunately, you were dumb and did, like, one damage with Constrict. Psybeam. Oppa Gundam style. <laughs> yeah, I apologize to the world for that. Oh, wow, well, our shrimp scampi is... Up to par with our wizard. I lost. Now you're feeling blue. Now that's too bad. I need to do some healing. I almost got myself killed in that battle. And in hindsight, I really... Well, nope, nothing down here. And yes, I have a repel spray. That's another thing on my hate list is Pokemon at a higher level than me. 
What will wild Pokemon? Like, see, I probably can't. Yeah, I can't escape. Shut. I should be able to escape. Thank you. Well, let's come down here, because there is a ruined maniac, and why did you have to walk in front of me so I have to surf now to get down there? He has a sand shrew. Sand shrew. <laughs> Back to the good old days of sand shrews. Psybeam. Yeah, in your face, you got confused. You have been confuzzled. Stupid poison sting. Oh, well, that's gonna do like two. Heh, that was right, it did do two. And yeah, I probably. How did you not just die? I hate you, stupid sun shrew. Oh well, you died anyway. Ah, oh, I'm so close to getting up a little. A sun slash. Man, you're wondering how this stupid little tiny ball toy could kill a sand slash, and the answer is I probably won't be able to if it keeps using sand attack. How does psychic miss? I mean, you are literally moving them in the air. I, oh no, I missed and I dropped you in the water. You died. I'm running out of PP. Critical hit did seven damage. Thank you, finally. That did like nothing. Alright, it's mud skipper time. Has I don't have if you if there was ever any doubt I got rid of water gun for surf. <laughs> surf has ninety-five power, water gun has forty. I probably didn't even need that critical hit. Um and both of them are hundred percent accurate. And our wizard is up to level twenty-five and we're trying to learn ancient power. Which is a cool move with stab, but not that useful if you don't have it, but as you can see, 60-100 is better than 50-80 of the same type. And a chance to boost all your stats is, in my opinion, much better than a guaranteed drop of speed. So we will learn Ancient Power. I really doubt we'll keep it the whole game, but it's nice to have. Ruin Maniac Foster. Don't register me, but you probably... Oh, thank you. Now we can walk down here. Now I forget, it seems like there should be a hidden item over here. But I don't know if there is. Nope. I believe there is over here. No. Oh no, it's a double battle. How do I... Okay, I'll get over there soon. But, um... Alright, she's over there. This is like a little tomb thing. This is where you come to catch Regice later in the game. After her. Um, you need to fight me. <laughs> My body feels lighter in the water. It's as if I've gotten slimmer. Newsflash, you haven't. I don't care if you think you have, but you have not. Well, actually, you might have gotten like slightly slimmer working, like swimming. Let's test out aren't that new move. Oh crap. No, that's not what the move is called. The move is not called crap. The move is called Ancient Power. That was boss. Boss Wizard! Sorry, that was absolutely necessary. Waymer! Waymer! Uh, how much more experience do you need to get up? You know what, you're going in. I don't care how crap you are, you're going in. <laughs> You have Bullet Seed, which, well, a terrible move is super effective, so... I should have used Fake Out, well... Ooh, I might get... no, oh, come on, hit five... no, two. Always hits two. Thank goodness that missed, because that actually would have done a lot more than you might think it would have. <laughs> Because my defense is really bad right now. Are you kidding? Fortunately, like, oh, okay, that only did four, but... Alright. 
Let me show you something cool. Nature power has turned into surf on water. Critical hit. That is like, well, not technically two straight critical hits, but. You know what? I normally don't do this, but. I am probably just gonna use the rare candies off screen on my. Um, Nuzleaf to get it to level 31, teach it faint attack, and then I probably may, I may not actually end up using it at all. Uh, ah, shoot. If I die, this episode is over. <laughs> if I survive... Yes. I don't even know why, well, yeah, because... Are you... Can I just please escape the wrath of this stupid Wingo? Oh, I, I'm just shockwaving this thing. I mean, I'll go up a level, I might as well. <clears throat> Alright, you know what? Screw that first, uh, they'll fight those two guys over there, and then that'll probably be the end of the episode. Come on, level 26! Yes. Alright, if I can... Repel's effect wore off. Fat lot of good the Repel's doing anyways. I'm exhausted from swimming and I'm just not used to it. I need a battle for a change of pace. I'm convinced that the sea keeps secrets from us. From battle for change of pace to sea keeping secrets from you, you two have just gone to a whole new world of crazy. Or at least that first guy has. Alright, bullet seed you, steal when you. Defense up, yeah. Okay, now that I've seen that Halo using double team, I already know that this is going to end up having coughing coming in to kill the tail. <laughs> And that sand shrew made bullet seed look good. Trust me, it's not. Um, are you gonna ask me if I want to switch or not? No, nope, you're not. But it's another sand shrew. Let's bullet seed you. Oh wait, swift never misses. Think of it. Wow, that stunk. And bullet seed you. Alright, after this battle, it will probably be the end of the episode. <laughs> I hate bullets. <laughs> Calm down. Oh wait, nature powers earthquake, so... Sure, that's only gonna kill the sand shrew, but maybe I can get lucky and kill the tail. Yes! Now have a not flying type. Nope, it's a window. <sighs> it, it won't affect Wingo, and it won't affect Bird Brain, but it will hopefully kill that stupid sand shrew. Yep. Oh, that's it. Wow. That's kind of weird. Oh, it's because of the double battle. That's why... It, like, normally the miss is only around the one token. Alright, die. Please. Hit three. Three. Just, I'm begging you. I swear, I am going to kill my Nuzleaf. I need that Leaf Stone so badly right now. Uh, you lost because you battled at sea. And you are no good at battling at all. No, I'm not willing to register you in the Pokenab. You're too weak. Alright! I say this is the end of the episode. Next time we will finish surfing back to Duford Town! Hooray! We were there already. Stay tuned.
since Mr. Briny won't give us a ferry ride anymore because he sucks.